If you're a heating and air conditioning technician or a salesperson, what's a word track that you could use to help build some momentum in the sales process? This is an important question. I'm Scott Tupperbell, coming to life for HVAC technician sales secrets on a perfect day to talk about sales and a perfect day to talk about you. Now, here's the thing. There's going to be times where people neglect their heating and air unit, their heat pump, their boiler, and you got to get them on board with, like, they've got things that they need to do. And there's going to be times where people don't want to look dumb. Like, nobody told them. When you buy a house, here's what happens. If you ever bought a house, here's what happens. Your real estate agent hands you the keys and says, pay your bills. That's it. There's no instruction manual that comes out. There's nothing that says, these are the things that you need to do. And if you've read it before, somebody else likely did everything for you. And so you may not know everything that you're supposed to do as a homeowner. There's not like a little instruction manual that like, or a phone call that you get every month. Hey, do these things. This is why you should join HVACTechSecrets.com. I'll give you the goods, not in the Facebook group, not on the YouTube channel. So the phrase that I want to give for you is it's not your fault, but now that you know, it's your responsibility. Okay. I got this from one of the best copywriters in the world. John Benson want to give credit where credit is due. John Benson, awesome dude, super cool guy, inventor of the video sales line. So the phrase is, it's not your fault, but now that you know it's your responsibility, you have to be very, very, very careful about how you say this, and you have to have good rapport with your buyer. Otherwise, it's going to create some issues. Ask me how I know, okay? So as you're having a conversation, and let's say they haven't been changing the filter in the ceiling, or they haven't been changing the filter in the furnace, or they haven't been changing the filter on the ground, you can have the, the, the conversation on a low tone. So I'd say, hey, Mr. or Mrs. Homeowner, here's the thing. It's not your fault that somebody didn't tell you you have to change your filter. But now that you know it's your responsibility and it's got to get taken care of the right way. Very calm. Very, but if you're like, hey, it's not your fault, Mr. or Mrs. Homeowner, but now that you know it's your responsibility. Like you see how like that, that's a bad feeling. That is sales slump building 101. Like you, it creates some problems. You have to be very aware of how you're interacting with a buyer before you roll this out. I promise you, you're gonna to wanna to role play a couple of times with your friend, okay? This is not like something that you just go into a call and you're like, oh, I'm gonna try this. I've never done this before. Hey, Mr. or Mrs. Buyer, it's not your fault, but now that you know, it's your responsibility. You're gonna to have to add words in there, okay? So let's say that you go out to the air conditioner and the outdoor coil is filthy and you're talking with the buyer and they're out there with you and. You're explaining, hey, like, look, I know you've been in the home for five years and I know nobody's told you that you need to get tune-ups done. Like, at the end of the day, it's not your fault. But here's what I need you to know. At, now that we've had this conversation, it's your responsibility to understand what needs to be done. Would you like a club membership, right? Maintenance plan, pro whatever you call it, right? I'm just going to call it a club for making it really easy, okay? So it's not your fault, but now that you know, it's your responsibility. If you're like, hey, Scott, I really want to sell more club memberships. I really want to sell more maintenance, ma maintenance plans. This is a perfect word phrase to help get you over the hump when somebody's giving you some resistance. Listen, Mr. and Mrs. Buyer, it's not your fault, but now that you know, it's your responsibility. You're gonna to have to elongate this and put your phrases in there. Listen, I know you haven't been changing your filter, wherever it may be. It's not your fault when you buy your house. Nobody tells you that you gotta do it. But now that you know, it's definitely your responsibility. We can help you out with that. We got drop shipping that takes care of it for you. You have to add your solution. The takeaway is you add the solution and you make it really easy for them. You're not chastising them. You're not telling them they're an idiot. You're not telling them they're wrong. That's how you lose deals. Ask me how I know. <laughs> you got one thing to do from here. It's your role and responsibility. Now that you know, it's not your fault you didn't know you needed to, su to subscribe. But now that you know, it is your responsibility. You got one thing to do from here, just one thing, find the subscribe button, click on it. And every time I send out a video, you'll get an update that says HVAC technician sell secrets on another fantastic video. You should check it out, which you should. We'll see you soon.